Good afternoon, everybody. Michael here again, back with another couple hours of Red Dead Redemption 2. I see I've got Asset, Million Rando, Dogwater Club, Glenny in chat. Good to see y'all. Let's see. Hope your day's been good. Mine has been pretty stellar. I had some work done on my car this morning. I was worried about it because it was making some kind of clickety noises when I was driving it from coming from the rear. Turns out it was just the back seats weren't folded in tight enough. So they, I guess they can sometimes partially latch. So it didn't cost me a dollar, which is really nice. Hey, Arthur. Hello, hello. Hello, DWC. So that was nice. It's always nice to go to a dealership. I, I like this dealership a lot, but, um, you know, you always worry about them taking a run at you for, because I can't, you know, on brand, brand, brand new cars, I don't feel super comfortable working on certain things. Uh, but yeah, how are you? What's new? What's happening in your world? Yep, we'll do an auto save. Oh, that guy. Yeah, well, I'll keep an eye out for him. I've, I've got my eye on, oops. I'm gonna keep my eye on chat. So be it. So anyway. Let's see. And then we'll get going. I really want to get some legendary animals um, hunted today. And I also want to check out the Northern Territory above uh, Wapiti. I ran through there and it looked kind of cool. It looked like there's a lot of stuff to check out. Hi, hey, how are you? Welcome back. Yes, yes, I've got dead eye on. I've got dead eye. Let me just get into the chat here so that I can see what, if they come up, I have a quick and easy option to turn them off. Driver guy, what's happening? I took your advice and ran up around the um, area above Wapiti on Thursday when I was grabbing my screenshot. Really nice place. Pretty dang cool. Hi, hey, what's happening? Oh, Amazing right on, Million Rando. That, that sucks, but glad to hear you're hunting as well. When I get to online, I'm looking forward to doing some of those challenges. Man, this is a beautiful scene right here. Yes, Arthur got some fancier clothes. I figured he needs some chaps. And I like the jacket too. He looks like he's fit to go out for a nice hunt. This is going to be a nice relaxing day. He's got his Sunday best on. Water drop. All right. Um, let's take a look at the map and see exactly what's out there as far as legendary animals go. So I've got this, this. I'm going to move pretty quickly because I think there are a few to hunt. But I know I've got a bunch of them already. And if there aren't any at the moment... Go close here. Okay, so there's the fish in the Dakota River. Ooh, meatloaf. Tasty. Thanks, Rando. I'll check it out. Uh, and then, of course, this looks like a wolf. I'd like to do that first. I'm going to try and take the wolf with a bow and arrow, I think. This is where I saw those buffalo, where the buffalo roam. And there's some carrots there that I could, if I, if I walked it, I could take along the way. Yeah, let's do that. Let's go see if... I'll pick up some carrots for the horse, and then I'll keep on heading down this way, and I'll try and hunt this thing with a bow and arrow. Yeah. Hey, Oda. What's happening? Morning. Happy Friday to you, too. Glad to be here. Uh, let's see. Pretty excited for... I, I like Friday. Fridays are like, you know, obviously at work they're good. They're pretty chill. Yeah, no politics in here. Um, but, uh, Oda, you, you may have missed it earlier. I... I the GTI went to the shop, and the clicking noise that I was hearing from the suspension in the back, it was the back seats not, like, completely clicked back in. Which is weird. It has, like, a little red tab that pops up when they're unlocked, and it went, like, 99% of the way down. So I'm guessing just out of the factory it wasn't, wasn't greased properly or something. Uh, the guy was really nice about it. The uh, tech was, well, he was like, don't worry, everybody does this. But it was good. It was a nice, nice morning out. I worked from their showroom, which was not bad. 
legendary beaver. All right, cool. Thank you, asset. How's your evening going, asset? I haven't ridden ridden Blanche in a while, so I decided to take her out of this the stable. I only have Blanche and Midnight, and they're basically the same horse at this point. If any of you have any suggestions for a the best hunting horse, I think I would like to add one. Yeah. Cause I don't I don't I, I see the differences in the horses, but it seems like like, I'm not exactly, I don't really understand them. I'm not fluent in it yet. Like, I get that Midnight and, and Blanche, the Arabians, are supposed to be fast. And they're supposed to be pretty nimble and strong and stuff. But which ones are good for, which ones are not timid when you're hunting? Like, who, which of the horse breeds? Does anyone know? Let's get some stuff for some carrots here. It's going fine until just now. Good. Nice, Rando. Let's see. I wonder if I can see carrots. I think I can. So this is just noting where I found some carrots. Okay, they gone. Okay, my girl. Snacks. Don't say that too loudly. Some of my family will show up. They're all about snacks. I had a sweet tooth uh, this week, and I bought mambas. Anybody ever have mambas? They're kind of like Starburst, but they're a little bit more like, maybe more waxy. They're delicious. I love them. Because I can't do chocolate and stuff. I can't do anything with caffeine in it. Idiot. Hold up. Why is it telling me to go the other way? Oh, okay, I see. It's sending me down the southern path here. Okay, American Standard Bread. I'll take a look for that. Now, I think I can just go into the different horse, like the tack shops, and just buy horses. But I probably, I would also like, it would be kind of maybe fun if we see some wild horses. I'd like an Appaloosa, like something spotted would be cool too. Even though, look at Blanche. She, she looks spotted right now. Let me clean her up real quick. You're okay, girl. Um... But also got my eye out for other things. I think the area north of Wapiti, the Indian Reservation, looks really, really fun. I, I don't like. I saw some um, buildings and, and you know out out buildings and stuff that I thought looked pretty neat. And uh, but I just ran up there because I wanted to see what it was like and take a nice screenshot. That's where I got my thumbnail for today. I thought it was a nice contrast of Arthur with his mean, like, military rifle and the beautiful flowers and beautiful view in the background. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, believe it or not, Blanche was a bit dirty. She was. Yeah, but Blanche is my white Arabian and um, Midnight is my black Arabian. So I think with the bow, I've got improved, uh, what am I doing here? Yeah, I've got improved arrows. I got 40 of those. So that'll be on hand. I think I can catch this little guy with a couple of arrows. What do you think? Thoroughbred. Oh God, no. Teddy Roosevelt. This was where the... Yep. 
Okay, so I'm curious now. Actually, let's go bow. I don't think I saw it say I was in territory, but it looks right on the map. Yeah, I think they're 8 or $12 here, depending on which smoke. Eyes up for some sort of sign here. Been a while since I've shot the bow, but I think I can get him with one well placed and then maybe a follow up shot. Assuming I'm in the right spot, I think I am. Ooh, question mark. Stranger, no way. Not today, but that's cool. Five quid, that's like ten bucks, right? Ten dollars, more or less. Quid is like a pound. Yeah, smoking's bad. It's very bad. I smoked for a long time. But I don't. Because it's terrible for you. I also grew up in a time when you could smoke in bars and restaurants and... Even the mall. I remember smoking at the mall when, when I was like a teenager. It was a thing. It's a lot easier to quit now because you can't smoke anywhere. At least here. You can't even smoke outside in the city of Santa Monica. You know, that famous Santa Monica where there's a pier and stuff. You can't smoke outside in that area. It's like a city ordinance. Where is this thing? Check the creek. Okay. Yeah, water source makes sense. Um, to go on the map. Maybe I'll start over there and head back this way. So usually it's right around where it calls it out on the map, but it didn't even give me a signal to say you're in legendary territory yet. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I've, I've had him smoke a couple, and he's not feeling it. He's not very happy when that happens. Look at all these animals. Just let me run up on him. Oh, black-tailed jackrabbit. Almost got it. Come on, let me study you. Not too far. White-tailed deer. Oh. No. Don't do it. It's something that never goes away. Like, I'm way past it now, but there's still many days and times where I'm like catch a smell of it, and even though it smells gross, you're kind of like, oh, I remember smoking. Don't do it, though. That's, I mean, do whatever you want to do, but I wouldn't advise it. And it's so expensive, too. They've done a good job about making it not a very good idea for a lot of reasons, including because it's costly. Hmm. Alright, I'm going to walk it back up. See if I can get this thing to respawn. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. It was, you had it everywhere. Like, I don't know. I remember being in high school and going to a friendly's diner and just drinking coffee and smoking cigarettes with my friends. It seemed like everybody did. What is that there? Is that a tree? Yeah, it's awful. DWC, I'm sorry that you had to witness that. Those guys are like walking a bull. Huh. Alright, this doesn't pop right up. I'll go on. Yeah. Um, sure, we can go up there. Worst case scenario, it opens like a, a mission. What, what was that? Something just shook. That's funny. The hummingbird sage. I don't think I've gotten any of this yet. Hummingbirds are awesome, huh? Cool. That's nice. The controller actually vibrated when I ran over those. 
Didn't know that. Gotcha. Let's see what it does if I eat it. <coughs> yep, he gave a little cough, but okay. Uh, Glenny, I'm hunting for the legendary, I think it's a wolf. Oh, okay, cool. I didn't realize who you were. Hi, hey. Sorry. Hi, hey was the, the person that has been bothering us, I think. So, I'm sorry, but that's where all that stuff was coming from. Yep, that's what I'm thinking, driver guy. Because it's I'm right on it where the map is, but I'm just going to... Worst case scenario, this mission or this str stranger comes up. I'll go with the flow, but there is a dry uh, creek bed over here, so maybe I can get down into it without triggering the stranger mission. Oh, it could be a coyote too. You're right. Sorry. I'm going based on the crude drawings. Ah, there's some stuff to pick, so that's not a loss. Let's see what that is first. Yep, I recognize the language. Ah, uh, more carrots. Good, just what I was looking for. Wonderful. Come on, girl. Alright, next keep it moving that was a good 15 minute try and we're not far I don't think ah yeah we are yeah we're pretty far from where's that fish no we're not we're not this will be an easy ride as a matter of fact I could probably fast travel to Nah, it's about the same. <laughs> yep, that's over. Uh, me, Glenny? Maybe the coyote's like a nighttime animal? That would actually make a lot of sense. Coyotes are pretty much out at night. I live in the suburbs of LA and I've seen coyotes running down the street here. It's kind of scary. Like in the in broad daylight once, but usually at nighttime they're, they're out. So maybe I'll come back at night and try and hunt that same spot. But I got some carrots and some a new um, herb out of it, sage, so that's good. Can't beat that. I'm gonna cut this turn. Save us a little time. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, don't be running off the cliff. Let's go easy down. Yep. Sell the coyote to the trapper. sorts of crazy stuff here. Uh-oh. Nope, nope, nope. Let's show them how free men do some killing. Nope. How about not? We'll run right by you. You're okay. Come on. Can't have anything nice. Yep. I knew what you meant. Oh, great music. I like that note that they just chimed. Oh, they're still coming. Come on. Come on, get a rifle out, buddy. There we go. Come on. And I had to do it, guys. Oh, I thought she was gonna buck me right there. That's providential. Oh, the 
What's that? An accordion? That kind of like honking sound? Agreed. MJ, we're on chapter six, but I'm not doing any of the storyline at this moment. I'm just doing hunting and fishing and doing some exploring. So far, it's proven to be pretty fun to do this every once in a while. Just chill out for like two hours and play. Welcome back. Thank you, asset. I like that you have that in your yeah. clipboard, or I hope you do. It's cool. It's very helpful. <laughs> DWC, that's alright. It's just a reward when you drink the glass of milk later. Be a little surprised at the bottom of some cookie mud. Uh, Limpany is the city that burned down, right? Or the village that burned down? Because I've been there, that's pretty cool. Definitely gonna do north of Wapiti, or whatever, north east of Wapiti, after a couple okay, of hunts here. Because I saw some cool looking stuff on off the path up there. Yep. I've been trying MJ to do everything, every mission along the way. I don't know if I've hit quite every single one of them, but I'm trying to do them all. Um, Cause I actually really enjoy all that, especially the ones that don't involve shooting. Like I love the Western appeal here and being an outlaw is lots of fun, but it's also cool to do other stuff like, you know, helping somebody take pictures or, um, you know, helping somebody to go collect herbs or, you know, all those other things. It's been pretty cool. Very satisfied with that part of the game. Yep, burned downtown. We went through that, I think, in the f somewhere in the first 10 sessions. I, I, I came across that. God, this was a long ride. I should have fast traveled a little bit. Here's a question for you. Can I, I guess I could try it, but can I put a, a, a mark down on the map? Like a, um, I don't remember what they call it, it's L3, I think, to put a little red point on the map and then fast travel hey, directly to hey, that. Oh, no, no, no. Nope. You gotta help me out here. Nope, no, no, no. Didn't hear you. Yeah, I'm not trying to get jumped again. Not right now. It's my day off, dang it. Arthur needs his day off. Yeah, I noped right away from that. Nope. Nope. I'm trying to go fishing, not trying to help anybody out right now. Arthur's a good man, but he deserves some time off. Just like we all do. Oh, and there's no no fast travel. I thought we were noping about the other thing, MJ. <laughs> Alright. That would be cool. That would be nice, but I get why they don't. Whoa! Should be right on top of it. Okay. It's not crossed out, is it? No. I was going to say it. Yeah. Yeah, that would be cool. But it would be... It would unlock the entire map to you whenever you want. Hey, duck! Can use that... Some duck fat. Okay. Get the rod going. I'm going to need the river lure. Hey, Alien Pancake. Happy Friday. It's not Zelda. Good call out. I like that. Um, bait. We're going to switch to the special river lure. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe this will work. And I'm going to pop one right in between all these rocks. I know that's dangerous in real life. You don't want to be fishing, like, in between all the rocks. But let's see if Arthur gets lucky. And Okay, there's something. Maybe not the Oh, uh, I was reeling too much. My bad. That's interesting. Uh Gobbler, I I just the the fact that you immediately come back with another account is kinda of part of the reason. Just trying to have a good time here. No politics, no, uh, no weird stuff, okay? You can hang out, but you don't have to be, like, saying weird things. No, no, you know, I don't have a single tattoo. I have no problem with them, but I've been into so many different things in my life that I've never felt compelled to 
make it permanent, I guess. There we go. No, definitely not legendary. I don't think that's a legendary. A little more, you're almost done. It's gonna be a little guppy. Look at <laughs> you! Yes! <laughs> it's about the size of an average. Oh, it's a big pickerel. pickerel. I was gonna say that actually looks like an a large pike, but if that's a pickerel, then a nine pound pickerel is a giant fish. That doesn't help, Rando. <laughs> You're going to scare the fish away. I like them too. I like tattoos as well, NJ. You, sir. Yeah, he's like, You're a real fish. All right, I'll keep her. See, little pickerel. That's interesting. Because a pickerel, I think you would often use for bait. And they would be little tiny things. Maybe use them to bait big fish. But a nine pound pickerel would be pretty big. He said something like that, asset. He said, like, Oh, you're a big fish or you're a big one oh that's cool MJ you have a bunch of tats I respect it I think it's super cool um, I think I'd probably pr be pretty good at doing them because I am slightly ginger and us gingers tend to have pretty high tolerance for pain at least I do and I think I could sit through a lot of tattoo sessions but again I just have not found I don't know anything that I really felt compelled to add to my body yet maybe if I was like cut up and in great shape I'd be more interested in doing it but here's, here's what I'm going to do I'm going to take that long run back I'm going to try and, and pick up what we believe is the coyote over here and hopefully during the run you know during the walk over it'll become nighttime. Um, I guess I technically could fast travel to Lagras and be a little bit closer but this is really in no man's land Emerald Ranch would be slightly closer, but I'm just going to get on it. Yep. <laughs> That's funny, Million Rando. Uh, you once caught an invisible fish in the game? That's funny. I've seen some invisible things. I don't know if you were here, but at one time I sat in the tent and Arthur was actually hovering, sitting outside of the tent. It's pretty infallible. I don't think I've seen this game glitch very much, but uh, it definitely does. It happens. Oh, that's interesting. I got a little Irish in me too. I'm a mutt though. I'm Irish, Russian, English, just everything. Right, yeah. Yeah, I've heard this clip a bunch of times, so we'll come back for that again some other time. I don't know if on the way over I doubt it highly, but is there a trapper between us? Yes. Uh... Nope, that's a horse fence, sorry. Hmm. Alright. I'm just gonna risk it. I'll do a quick save since I got the fish. Elson Marie, thank you for subbing. Appreciate it. I'm Michael, nice to meet you. Wait till online for the glitches. That's awesome. And Rendo, you you have uh you've been bit? by a coyote in the game. They are, okay, they're gonna be a little nasty. I'm excited, I kinda wanna have a good bow and arrow kill. I've seen a lot of coyotes here, not in any dangerous situations. Uh, maybe one time I was out riding my motorcycle and there was a coyote standing like right in the middle of the road. And there was no way for me to go, it was like rock wall on one side and cliff on the other, so I just rode by it. Couldn't have been more than six inches from me. They looked pretty scared though. Yeah. Uh, you know, MJ, that's, that, that is interesting. Um, I have a friend who stops in every once in a while, and, and he, uh, what is it that he says every time that, I, I, may, I may be mixing people up, but in, in Ireland, is it common for someone to greet another person by saying, well, because I'm, for some reason, I'm remembering that being Irish, and one of my friends that comes here every once in a while is... Irish and talks about how the language is, how the language works and stuff, because I love language. Oh, man. 
You're in real life, yeah. Coyotes are nasty. We just had some coyotes on the beach here bite some little girl that was out at like dusk, hanging out with her folks. Uh, we gotta watch those grizzlies, Gobbler. They do. They will. Uh, I know. Last stream, we we just watched. I accid. Uh, not, not accidentally. I naively watched a hunter get mauled by a grizzly. It was pretty crazy. Yeah. All right, awesome, MJ. That's great. Yeah, my friend Dermot comes in here every once in a while. And um, he always says, well, and I think I, I'm supposed to say well back. Well, that's definitely not the way we would do it here. Here it would be like, well, well what? I get it though, it's a really, it's a really endearing way to say hello. And now I know for when I eventually visit. Oh, that sucks, Gobbler. You lost it all because you... Okay. There we go. Alright, it's not night yet, but I'm gonna take a sleep until nighttime. Let's see how this works. No. Rando, you gotta hold the gun. Yeah. You gotta hold it. Let's sleep until nighttime here. Um... Why, well, it's gonna be like right in the middle of the night. We'll see. We'll see what happens here. Ah, cool. Tear down camp. Let's start looking. <laughs> okay, I'm <MJ. laughs> Yeah, I, I started learning how to shoot when I was like 10 or 11. And you're right, you know. I mean, now I have a 30 out 6. That's my hunting rifle. And, um, but I mean, oops, where's my horse? Give me that girl. Ah, uh, yes. But yeah, when I was young, I carried a 22 for many years. Just because it was easier to shoot. I'll do that, and then I'll have the. There's my slug shotgun. Yeah, that on backup. And then the knife is the last resort. No problem. Okay, there's some more stuff to pick up. Can't carry anymore. Can I eat some more? That's cool. I find it's one of those things. I grew up like in kind of farm country, so it was it was a thing. I'm glad. Taught me a lot about safety. My dad was in the military too, so and his dad was a hunter and also a military man. Later, MJ. Thanks for stopping through. I'm playing Revelations tomorrow morning. Yep, I'll be back at 7 a.m. Pacific Standard Time with more of that. Oh, probably a 30-30 million rando. I hunted with one of those when I was, like, late teenager. That was kind of my stepping stone into bigger guns. Yeah, 7 a.m. PST. Yes, okay, here we go. Hey, you got to uh, go away, go someplace else for yeah. now, okay? Come on. Let, let Papa hunt you. Yeah, it's the one where you shoot and then you cock it with your, like, the front of your hand instead of the other way around. I don't know. I don't know if it's MJ, like what it stands for. All right. All right. Arthur's like, Let's see. Something. Oh yeah, that's uh, definitely Coyote. I've been here a while. Oops. Gotcha. Oh, there's lots of stuff to pick right here. 
Theo, how are you? Happy Friday, dude. Glad to have you here. Asset, I think I'm picking up the tracks right now. Here we go. A little coyote fur. He's giving it the sniff test. Yeah, still a ways. Yeah, it's a little ways away. So she went, or it went this way. Streams blurry. Give it a re uh, refresh. Unless anybody else has seen it, I, I all my numbers over here look really good. Sorry about that, though, Rando. Yes, speak of the devil. Oh, I see what we're going to come up on here. There's lots of stuff to pick right here, and then there's a carcass. Just being wary, because if I'm going to get him with the, Kaya, uh, with the uh, bow and arrow, this is going to be probably a, have to be a very good shot, but also kind of quick. Oh, it's a ship. Thank you, sir. Gotta be close. Thanks, Gobbler. Might as well. Get some flowers. Uh, asset, I, that's a really good question, and a logical question, because it, it's, it shouldn't work this way. But I'm using an HDMI capture device from Elgato. So you put, it's kind of hard to explain, but you put the HDMI from your PS4 into this device and then it goes into your computer and it gets you what you need. Looks good though, huh? It's nice that, and I have a green screen behind me um, and I'm in my office. It's a little like 10 by 10 room. Uh, what's this? Oh, dinosaur bone. What? Sweet. I found a dinosaur bone. That's a first. Thank you, coyote. You have led me to something I was searching for. Awesome. One of 30 found. I've only been playing this game for like 100 hours. Okay, there it is. I'm going to be able to sneak right up on you. Stand up again. Yes! Was that a headshot or what? Oops. Yeah! A headshot. I'm still getting headshots. That was awesome. That felt really good. I called and then it stood its head up. Legendary coyote. Let's skin this thing. Oh, study it first. Shit. Wait, wait, stop, John, or Arthur, no. My bad. Uh, Rando, I'll, I'll think about it. I'm not really sure it's the weekend, so I'm playing tomorrow morning Assassin's Creed on PS3. <laughs> yeah, this is all green screen. The, the hat, the headphones, everything. But yeah, I pretty much, like, I pretty much play games I do a little gaming on my own on the side, but it's often like very impromptu. This, these are like my scheduled times, but I'll I'll give you a shout if I'm if I get free time. It's also Mother's Day weekend, which makes it tough. All right, so I didn't get to, I didn't necessarily get to uh, get it in the compendium, I guess, but it worked. It worked. Success. That, that felt really good. That was a nice shot. That felt like real. Like, I, I haven't done bow hunting. I would love to someday, but that felt pretty real. Thing just looked up and pow. It was over. Uh, 7 a.m. I don't know. Um, I'm in the Pacific Standard Time, so I'm in L.A. time. If, the, if you're in front of a web browser and can look up the difference. 100 bonus That's points. Thank no you, girl. Asset. Um, did I ship the fish? That's a really good question. I think I did. Pretty sure I went right there and shipped the fish. Oh, I didn't ship the, the, the pickerel yet. I gotta do that. 
So let's find a post office to ship it out, which I think is going to be Emerald Station. Yeah, that's probably closest. And I believe I can just fast travel to Emerald. So let's, uh, actually, fast traveling and hunting has been a little weird. So I'm going to just run it out. Yeah. Hope you guys don't mind. I think that's the best place to go. It's also heading north, which is the way I want to go next, because that's two legendaries in the first 45 minutes. Now I want to spend some time exploring. Yeah. And maybe, maybe we'll find another legendary animal north of here somehow. Roads? Oh, right on. Yep, I'm actually three hours behind Eastern time. Uh, roads, roads, roads. Oh, duh. Yeah. Good call. I don't know why I always picture roads to be way over on the other side of the map. I mix that up a lot. Like it's 3.42 p.m. for me right now. Rando. But like I said, I, like, I, I don't want to promise you or make you feel like we're going to play this weekend because I doubt it. Because I, I already have, like, three hours of gaming scheduled. And my wife will literally kick me out of the house if I play more than, like, ten hours a week. <laughs> and when I do, it'll be, like, late night if she wants to go home or something. And that might work if our time zones are right. But also, I haven't played any online yet, and I kind of want to save the beginning of that for streaming here with you all. So just, just be aware. Probably not this weekend, but I appreciate it. <laughs> I bet that's it. <laughs> well, maybe I should change that to Happy Weekends. Jeez, Arthur, chill. Seriously, man, getting moody. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I knew what you meant. Yeah, three in the afternoon for me, that's prime time. Weekend, wife and dog time and family. Like Saturday, we're gonna take our camper out and actually go and set up shop at a friend's house, hang out there. And then on Sunday, we're watching the Formula One race, which is in yeah. Miami, which should be neat. It'll be like at middle of the morning and then um, going out to see her mom and dad to celebrate Mother's Day with them. Oh, Morning. I said hello and ran, run face first into a bush. Yep, you're three hours difference, just like my family. <laughs> I said it'll get you every time. Yeah, I know there are a few of us in here that have... have uh, time zones are so funny. And I know I've said it before, but this is like the most... Streaming has been like the, mo the strongest connection to that idea of like yeah. distance and time zone to me in my whole life. And I lived in Asia for a little while and stuff, so I understand what it's like, but it's insane how many different time zones we represent. Yes, F-122 just came out. I think they're just going to call it. So they usually do the full year. This year it's F-122. I'll get it eventually kind of have to because the cars changed this year so driving the old one is not not like the new cars so especially in a simulator I, I like the way that right, I want it to be modernized uh, I don't think so I, I, it's pretty soft on the back I might though a very good morning to you good morning here's everybody's favorite ah welcome back sir hey Alden you're in luck. Next mail train leaves soon. Oh, cool. So I can also s ship out the Scarlet Meadows, Meadows Dewberry Creek Bone location. That's so cool. Good is there already. I did. In um, 2011, I lived in the Philippines on the main island called Makati in uh, Manila. The city is called Makati and the island is called Manila for work. And they set me up out there with a, uh, a first stayed in a really fancy hotel the first few times I visited and then they set me up up out there with an apartment and um, I ran a team there and also remotely ran a team here in Los Angeles it was like 50 people all together it was insane 
I was a very, very tired person during that time of my life, but it was awesome. It's a really cool experience. Okay, Rando. Good night. Thanks for stopping through. Happy Friday or Saturday. Happy weekend. All right, so now I'm just going to look. I, th I think that's pretty much it for legendary animals for the moment. I mean, there's others that I probably could stumble across, but I would really like to go up here and check out... Let's see, where was that? This one. This, this line is where I ran out for my... Um, Screenshot, so I just ran up here. It's pretty cool. So I'm going to do some exploring up there. I think there's stuff to find. And to do that, I will actually just get out of town and then fast travel to the Indian Reservation. Cool. Thanks. I'll be here. Looking forward to it. Assassin's Creed Revelations is great. I'm nearing the end of that one, too. Yeah. action a little bit. All right, cool. Nope, not yet. Thank you, driver guy. Yes, asset. I'm I've done so far AC2, AC Brotherhood, and of course, now I'm finishing up with AC Revelations. I want to go on to AC3, and then I'm going to probably switch gears for Saturdays. I might switch over to like The Witcher 3, or Ghost of Tsushima, or something like that. But I'll be, I'll be back. I want to play many, many of them. I actually have a good friend, a Belgian friend who is a master at Assassin's Creed games. And so he hangs out and talks with me on voice while we're playing and he can see a pretty much live view through Discord. Um, I'm just gonna fast travel to uh, PT. Hey, good morning, Grim Reapers. Is it Saturday for you already? Saturday or Friday? Gotta be Saturday, right? Um, seven. I picked the number seven. I agree, at least the majority of them that I know of. In fact, my friends uh, kind of sometimes makes fun of the French uh, because it's French Canadian. I don't recognize it because that's the only French I've ever learned, but um, yeah. The Montreal game scene is pretty cool because I think this game was developed in Montreal too, right? I know they at least have Rockstar North is in either Montreal or Quebec somewhere. Oh yeah, you heard me right. Have you played Ghost of Tsushima? I hope I'm saying that right. Uh, I have it here somewhere. Oh, never mind, it's out by the PS5. I haven't installed it, I haven't even taken it out of the plastic wrap yet, but my brother got it for me for my birthday, so. Oh, cool, I'm glad to hear you love it because that probably means I'll love it too. You seem to have great taste in games so far, so good, good, good. I'm excited about it, it's... Uh, I forgot to do it on the trapper. Shoot, is there a trapper nearby? No, huh? Oh, that was kind of a misstep. Let me go to An Annisburg real quick. <sighs> Sorry, y'all. I should just get this thing off my horse, though. Oh, no. Well, play um, no build Fortnite. I would, I mean, I, I don't know, I haven't played Fortnite in a long time, but if I were going to play it again, I'd play no build. That, that seems like a really, or zero build, whatever it's called. I think that seems like a really good idea, because that's what turned me off to Fortnite beyond, I don't know, it was, people got too good, but. Yeah, no trapper. I'm just going to go to Annisburg real quick. Bear with me. Um... But yeah, once the building came along, I was out of my league. I couldn't couldn't play. People were building so quick while I was just like barely able to put up some barriers and stuff every once in a while. All right, alternately, what if I picked number three? What would that be? Hey, Salmon Hun. How's it going?
I'm really good. Friday was good to me, and uh, I'm in my happy place playing some Red Dead Redemption with my friends. There you go, GTA 5. I support that all day. That's a better choice. Sorry, Fortnite fans, but I think GTA is a much better game. All right, now let's get out, go to the Trappa. Try not to get in any trouble here. Oops, no, no, no. Got its way out. Asset, I've never played God of War, but I see it on PlayStation now. Um, but if I can, yeah, if I can make some time for it, I'll check it out. Uh, it's good to have a disc-driven system. That was a re requisite for, or an ask that I had for PS5. Call me old school, but I like, I like the physical discs whenever I can have them. Yes, good disclaimer. Hey there, mister. Oh no. Yeah. You there? What's your business here? Running. Morgan, you are a dead man. Turns out I'm not a dead man though. This is not gonna be how I die. I'm gonna keep bobbing and weaving, bobbing and weaving. You got this girl, don't worry about it. Don't worry about those men. We're gonna get her away from them, we're good. Hey, move! Okay, cool. I do have a PS3 right here, and I connect it in the same way that I do with my PS4, so I'll look at it. Uh, right down the street, well, around the corner from me, there is a game shop that like primarily focuses on retro games, so they have everything. I'll go grab one of the early God's of War, God of War games, unless you have a specific recommendation on PS3. Interesting DWC. I'm probably going to go, you know, eventually have to go digital for more things, but I really do prefer, you know, when it's like a driving game or something, I don't mind digital as much. Because I don't think, yeah, I, I don't know why, but when it's like a storyline game, and just from my experience, I wonder how long, like, how long are they really going to keep the PS5 servers up? What if you want to play PS5 in like 20 years? You know, like I play my PS2. If that was reliant on some network that PSN had to manage, I would not be happy. How's Arthur doing, by the way? Maybe we we'll get him a little bit of food. No, his health looks good. Oh, jeez. John Wilkes Booth. Welcome. Hello. Ooh, Resident Evil 1. Uh, yeah, I'd probably play uh, retro, some retro games too, I wouldn't mind. Because, I mean, they're not going to make physical editions for PS5. Oops. Good to see you again. Wrong button. Okay, let's take a look at it. Let's take a look. Oh, call her over. Yeah, there she is. Right, let's see. Ah, that's fun. Yeah, dog, like, I got... Let's see, I want to be accurate here. I got... This many PS3 games. This is like all of the early Assassin's Creed games, Grand Theft Auto episodes from Liberty City and Gran Turismo 5. Uh, maybe I didn't get Gran Turismo 5 there, but every for like my 20 bucks. Is a little different. It was every pelt pretty is nice. Different. You'll find them nowhere else. All right, let's get this pelt going on. I assume it's this bottom one. Legendary coyote pelt. There you go. Once in a lifetime, eh? <laughs> oh, cool. Yeah, John. <laughs> a, little, a little weird, but welcome. Hang out if you'd like. Just right, uh, let's have a look. be cool. 
be cool. I don't think I have anything else to sell. All right. Now, on to the plant. Thank you, thank you. Hey, I mean, that's a good idea. have a cougar following us a little bit here show yourself oh maybe it was a bear hmm. yeah. whatever it is it's gone now back to the reservation to do some exploring and checking out oh, some yeah. of these outbuildings that I saw up above there I don't know if it'll be interesting to y'all but I'm kind of pumped I haven't seen this part I guess because the the game hasn't dragged me up there yet. Back up to a PT because I think I'm ready now. Favorite GTA game by far is Vice City favorite game. There are some really great ones. GTA 5 is awesome. GTA 4 was brilliant. I haven't finished GTA 5, but I know it's good. I'm enjoying it a lot. But yeah, for me it's Vice City because I think in the timeline of playing those games, Vice City was the first time that like you got motorcycles. It got really good really quick. And my only caveat is that you have to immediately turn off Blur because they, on PS2, I think to make the to make the graphics look a little smoother, they put a blur over the whole game and I turn it off. But I would love to, uh, and I plan to play the, um, I think there's a remastered edition. I'm just going to walk her through. This will be a cool scene. Um, there's a remastered edition I just saw this on way. PS4. I'm going to check it out. Cool. Yeah, it's an awesome one. Oh, yeah, San Andreas is really, really good, too. That, again, that was another, what do we call this? Um paradigm shift right where like it went from rockstar having like this really cool game engine to like rockstar having this huge huge expansive open world game engine beyond what they had already proven they could do and uh cj was a great character there's a lot of good characters in that too good call i also love vice city it's near and dear i, I wouldn't say i'm like a super fan or anything but i am a fan of the scarface movie um it's got a great soundtrack and as i've said before i'm really into music soundtracks um uh, Giorgio Marauder just crushed that soundtrack. It's so good. And, um, and also the movie's insane. But, uh, but yeah, I like the way that it kind of paralleled the, the, um, Scarface story in a way. And, um, yeah, that's, that's easily the best one ever. Yep, we're all big guys. Big kids, grown-ups. <laughs> Oh, wow. So you played Grand Theft Auto Vice City on a PC first. That's really cool. I I don't think I ever played, well, other than the original Grand Theft Auto, the top-down games. I don't think I ever played GTA on a PC. Maybe I had GTA 4 on PC, now that I say that out loud. I'd have to check Steam, but I might. Thanks for watching over things, driver guy. And Sam, please be good. Hang out. Have a good time. We're here for... Uh, oops. Yeah, I might as well save. We're here for a good time. You've joined a, a good group of people that I think all have uh, similar personalities. So we're very accepting, except for, like, inappropriate, too inappropriate or trolly stuff. It's not worth it. So I'm going to head out this way. And actually, first, I'm going to check out... I don't remember what this is, but there's nothing written next to it, so I'm assuming I haven't seen it. Yep. Thank you, gents. Let's see, what time is it? 8.43. You know what time it is. It's time. 
for the miners cap. I know this is such a well-loved feature, at least on my part. Sure. What's your question, Simon? Maybe I can help. Same here, asset. 100%. Who's whistling? Is that Arthur? Oh, it's the guy. Oh. Yep. I think we're nice to everybody, John Wilkes Booth. Okay there. Where is the dude? I have this hat on. Mysterious Hill Home. Ah, oh, sweet. All right. Yeah, it's the guy with the herbs, for sure. Wonder who lived here. Uh, Frodo? Bilbo? Can I go inside? Hmm. Nope, can't kick the door. Give it a boot. Give it a boot. Come on. Nope. The whistling is kind of eerie, but he is over there, I think. Yeah, this is awesome. Little hobbit house. Oh, I spy. Hello. Yeah. Thought I saw something down there. Um, just chewing tobacco, huh? Poison arrow pamphlet. Yeah, I can't carry any more chewing tobacco. Let's inspect. The true outdoorsman must be able to surmount all difficulties, whether saddling a wild horse, traveling a rat, tra trenelling a raft, or dispatching wildlife or savages that pose a threat. In some cases, the firing of an arrow into a man or a large beast will only enrage them further and result in harm to your person. The ancient Greeks and Romans understood this and often coated projectiles with poisons. So it's arrow, feather, and oleander plant. Okay. William, the man with the herbs. Okay. Maybe... No? I'm on top of the world! That's like a turtle. Did Donatello live here? Ah, oh, I like the... You can see they have their stove or whatever. Alright, let's go see... Let's see, what time is it? No, you know what, it's already 4 o'clock. I'm gonna keep going up. I'll come back now that I know he's here. I'll come back. You hungry girl? Here, have a carrot. There. You done good, girl. Uh I'll go with lucky number thirteen on that one, Dog Water Club. I'll get the turtle later. Okay. I figured since there was nothing to do there other than pick up that yep. um pick up that item. Okay, I'm going to keep going to the left. And I'm going to have a rifle out. Hey, Oda Dribat, I don't want to pressure you in any way, but when's your next stream? What? I'm confused about what's happening in chat. Um, but 
I'm not. I, is there a joke that we're missing, guys? Yeah. yeah thank you. Like, just. I don't. I don't understand. <laughs> I get the weirdest feeling that we know you. Your vibe is very familiar to me. So, just chill. Relax. Thank you, driver guy. That's exactly what I think is due right now. Get back. Uh, I hear coyotes. Down with you. Down with you. And where's your last one? All right, all right, girl. It's okay. It's all right. You're okay. It's all right. Yeah, huh? Some wolves in this town. Or in this part of town, rather. Two-star gray wolf. I don't know if I've seen gray wolves before. But I got them. Uh, they're probably all going to be two stars because I shot them. Alright. I'll still skin them, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, we're getting good at this. <laughs> I think that's pretty fair, DWC. I'm pretty sure it's the same person. I think those two people might have been the same person, actually. I, I just don't get it. Like, this is supposed to be entertaining and fun, not not cringy. But anyway, thank you very much, mods. Appreciate you. I guess it's all part of growing on YouTube. It's kind of what I've been telling myself lately. Cool. Okay. Well, keep me posted Sunday night, depending on what happens with the in-laws, we'll see, but I'll, I'll definitely do my best to be there. And I'll grab one more just for, because I feel bad having to kill all three of these things, might as well use them for some reason. Oh, and I got dead idol level eight. See, look at that. Glad I did that. Okay, yep. onward. So hopefully the the sun is going to come up here shortly. <clears throat> this was a really beautiful area. Like there was some cool stuff when I was running up here earlier. I can't believe I ran right past the Hobbit House, though. I, that's not what I was talking about. I was talking about another house or kind of location that we're going to come upon here. Yeah, I think so, driver guy. And I'm, it's it's. I'm sorry for it, but. It's a thing. I'm sure there's a very fine tightrope that YouTube has to watch to make discoverability work, but also allow people the like, freedom to do what they need to do. Yeah. Asset, I plan on doing that as well. You know, Oda, I find it's really good for me. Like I said, I don't have a ton of free time in life, but this is what I choose to fill most of it with, and I really love it. It's great for me. This, this is a great game. Um, but also I like streaming because it gives me an opportunity to connect with you and everybody else, and I don't know, it's cool. I guess I learned something from the pandemic after all, even though it felt like a big pain the whole time. This is actually pretty a pretty cool side effect of it. Yeah, like, look at this. That's awesome. Look how far you can see out into the plains. Yep. I hope they do a remaster. That'd be really cool. Without mucking it up. Sometimes things don't go so well, like the... Wait Whoa, What is this? Easy. I believe I passed something. I did. This is the other... This is the building I was talking about, and wanting to check that out is another thing I want to do, but... Yep. First... Yeah, I guess so. Uh, I don't, you know, I, I, I hope I hope he's enjoyed himself because I mean, it's just one of those things. It's such a s strange pursuit.
Yes, that's what I'm thinking. Danger's coming. Hey, there's... Easy, whoa. Oh. Okay, those are just white pistols, so they're not interesting to me. Thing back here. That dude's dead. Rat's eating him. Brown rat. Study, study. Nice. Compendium updated. Stupid. Alright, well, this dude's dead. And, oh, jeez, a horse kind of scared me there. This dude's dead. I guess they won't mind if I pick this box. Hey, Salmon Hunt. Um, I don't know who Nico Bellic is, but it's a nickname that someone used to come in and kind of like grief my stream a little bit. It was really kind of cringe, but they haven't been back, so hopefully they won't be. Can I take this hammer? That'd be pretty cool. No. Alright, looks like that's it. Interesting, I can't loot them, so it's almost like they were killed and looted. Oh yeah, I, I agree, Asset. That's a really good way to say it. Let's see. I think I already did the witch hunt. Or the witch hut. You can do hammer as a weapon in GTA 5 as well. Yeah, I'll block seven. Thank you. Oda got it already. Yep. I get the weirdest feeling that Hi Hey, Salmon, and John Wilkes Booth are all the same person, and I feel really bad for that person, but I wish they would. Just leave us alone. I got empathy for not being happy, and I understand how that works, but I don't think any of us did anything to uh, to deserve that. Oh, wait a minute. Hold up. Stalker hat? Yeah, that's what it's for. Hey, hey, wait a minute. Did I just throw a hat yeah. off? This miner's hat. Come on. Got to stay in my pocket. I forget if it stays in inventory or not, or how I switch it back. Yeah, I guess I just have to. Yes, best mods. Yes, it is. Both of you guys, thank you so much. Yeah, so now I can't pick it. This part's a little confusing to me how the hats work, so I'll just leave it on. I don't want to lose my minor yeah. hat. Totally. And I feel bad for him. Like, I understand it's like you got nothing better to do or you just are angry at the world, but just, life's too short. Thank you very much, moderators. Thanks for being here. So now we got this lookout. I want to go check. Hey there! What I give for a horse as fine as that. Oh, that's nice. Give me props for Blanche. See, there's got to be tons of stuff up in the mountains here. 
A little capsize. There we go. So once the hat's in inventory, you never lose it. Okay, let me see what happens if I go here. I think I was wearing the stalker hat. See, there he doesn't float, throw it on the ground, so I, I must have just done something wrong in a weird way. But that's good to know. Oh, is there? Is the true sign of getting older the fact of pulling out a full white nose hair? <laughs> yeah. I mean, you've made it. You've, you're very accomplished. Your body has produced something that I never expected to hear. So yeah, I think that might be part of it. Okay, so let's uh, first let me see what's upstairs. This has got to be a great view. I only rode by this last time, or Wednesday. Ah, uh, yep. Pretty sweet. Hey! Throwing knife, apple... Ginseng elixir, nice. Oh, I'm glad asset. I love showing other people things. Uh oh, is there men coming? Who are these boys coming down? See, like this location has to be full of stuff. Who's that? Is there a man standing right there? Oh no, that's a wolf or something hanging. Still, might be something over there. Yeah, this is crazy. And it kind of makes sense too, because east of the mountains, right? So these mountains run north to south, looks like. Or do they run east-west? No, I guess they run east-west. So it's, it's cutting across the map. Here. Oh, cool. So that connects all the way out. I see a few more little boxes here that I can check out on the way over, though. Because I didn't do... What's that called? A shanty? Oh, I missed one. Huh. Now, driver guy said something about... There you go. Come on down, bud. Nope. Maybe from... this side. Hmm. <laughs> He's just gonna rest. No. That's not what I wanted to do. Do I have a donation link? Um, I do, Rando. Thank you for asking. Uh, I don't know how to get it from here. That's a really good question. I do have one, Rando, but um, I don't have it handy. It's my loss, but thank you for the thought. It's really nice. Go to the north after? Okay. Some cleanup stuff. Trunk? Gun oil and cover scent. Oh, so this is like a hunting cabin. Predator bait. That makes sense. Oh, to the letter N. Okay. Now you said there was basement. Oh, there is a basement. Look at that. Oh, that's super nice, Rando. Thank you. What I'll do is I'll set something up so that I, I should put that in my description or something, I guess. Look at all this. All right. I don't mind if I do. Hey, Cameron. Welcome. Yeah, I should. I should. That's a great idea. 
Thank you for mentioning it, Rando. Give me two seconds here. Let's see if I can actually make that happen. Oh yeah, so if you go to streamlabs.com slash Mr. Michael Mus, I'll type it in the chat. I do have that. That should take you there. Thank you very much for the thought. Ah, cool, Cam Cameron. You sound like a like-minded person. Welcome. I'm Michael. Nice to meet you. Welcome to the gang. This is cool. I like the detail. You've got like a gunsmith's shop here with a bunch of gun making tools, some uppers and lowers, and a, that looks like a pistol that's totally taken apart. Tools on the wall. Are they. Oh, they're also doing some leather work in here. Ah, this is really cool. Wonder what's in here. This is a good find. I like this. This would be a good place to like kind of have your base for hunting in general cool no no i didn't uh, mean to pressure you or anything but to um driver guy's point it's a good idea really smart thinking okay can't go in the outhouse by the look of it thank you cameron appreciate that and welcome in welcome to the gang so to speak ah uh, see i would like this axe as well I know I could, I already have a hatchet, but yes, yes, yes. All right, quick save. I'm going to look around a little bit to see if there's anything more at this um, location, but then we're going to backtrack back to that one building, uh, the outbuilding I missed. Ooh, biscuits. Like some biscuits. And that's it, huh? Okay. So like there's some, like, pills and other stuff in there, but... Stew? No stew. This is a nice sight. Gun oil. It's over here. Anything? No. Alright, back to it. Okay then, girl. Get up. Easy now. Easy now. We doing so far it's one thing it's actually kind of hard for me to see because i look at i only see chat and i don't get it doesn't give me any statistics about that so we're going over to the end right here I missed it missed it morning run away while you came ah, fine I just time. Fine, yes. <laughs> a little traffic there oh cool Thanks, y'all. Thank you very much. Where's Mrs. Muss? Mrs. Muss, have you liked the stream yet? You're sort of married into this. Not sort of. You're officially married into this. Hey, D Gaming. How's it going? Happy weekend to you. Whoa. I ran right by this, too. What are you doing? Hey, get yourself out of there. Okay. Just minding my own business. Okay. You goddamn idiot. Yeah, whatever you say. D Gaming, how's your week been, bud? Okay, so here's where I picked out those. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. 
She's so touchy sometimes. Blanche. Good morning. Oh, hey, good morning. Uh, you good, girl? <laughs> okay, here we go. Well said. Thank you, Dog Water Club. Okay, this is kind of weird. What are we looking at here? It's like a... a house made of vines? This is a pretty cool structure. Somebody knew what they were doing. I reckon. The corrugated metal there. Oh, oh, uh, someone said this earlier. This is a witch's, there's a witch's kettle, some flat, um, some candles, and that is a nice, this is a nice rack. Wow. What's that, a one, two, three, four, five, six, twelve pointer? Wow. Nice grab. Take some snake oil. I don't know this person. Drink mysterious liquid. Hmm. Take some. <laughs> Don't drink from that, please. <laughs> uh, you know I'm considering it. Maybe I could save real quick. Kentucky bourbon. Hair tonic. Nope, we're good. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Rando. Hey, thank you, Oda. It works. It works. Thank you so much. I love hearing that music, too. I wrote that little ditty. Do it. All right, I'm going to save first because I, I don't know. I trust y'all, but I want to just see what happens. I want to make sure that I have a, an exit strategy here. Yes, thank you, Asset. Thank you, Oda. Appreciate that, dude. The, hearing that music, it's been... Gosh, I don't remember the last time I received a tip. So that was really cool. Thanks. Oh, it didn't play for you? Hmm. No sound, huh? It didn't show your message. <laughs> I see your message. Do you want me to read it to the class? Ah, <laughs> uh, good, Rando. I hope you took it easy. Give him a couple of smarts. Oda said, please have my babies. <laughs> Glenny, I think I'm going to drink it. I think I'm going to. I don't I, I don't see anything else here to take. Um, the last thing to do is just drink it. Yeah, I missed whatever was said, so no harm. Oh, moonshine. Okay. Let's do it. I missed whatever was said, asset, so don't worry about it. Good. You know, I gotta take a quick screenshot. Bear with me. Ah, he's like pouring it into his eye from that angle. All right, real quick. Uh, you know, Glennie, earlier someone said something about it, but really what I did is just looked on the map and found a little box, like a little square on the map. But it is under the N in Ambarino. I have no idea what's going to happen next. 
Uh, we'll call this Arthur Potion. Because that sure does look like a potion. It did glitch a little bit. Oh! Dun dun dun! It's an Easter egg. Okay, look like the effects were good. Something good happened out of that. That might be a new thumbnail. Yep. Certainly might be. Where... Huh. So I just passed out and... Come on, girl. Walked away and got my health back. Seriously creepy. That's it. Everything looks relatively the same. Uh, I've been to a couple pig farms. Hi, bird. Western Raven. Yeah, no harm done. That wasn't bad. Ah, oh, that's cool. Dreamcatcher action up there or something. This does look gnarly, though. I can only imagine the person that lived here. Interesting that he didn't note it on the map. Well, what happened to Glenny? Oh, there we go. Witch's Cauldron. Glenny, what happened? What what did Glenny say? Yeah, that was pretty cool. I see that Glenny got um oh, there was a spoiler in there. Okay, cool. Yep. Remember, I'm only on chapter six, so I've only been so far. I know you mean well. I and I think everybody, most everybody does. Alright, next stop. Lenny, three hundred seconds is like uh five minutes or something so hopefully I'll see you again next stop I want to see what's at this box here we'll go past over hill yep okay there yeah oh boy here we go Now we'll run on by back the way I came. Yeah, yeah that sounds right. Oh man, Blanche is dirty again. Look at these multicolored flowers and stuff on the hill, it's pretty cool. All right, Rando. Have a great night. Nice talking with you. Uh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Try to shy away from them. Appreciate it. What's up? Bahia Svelte TV Shorts. Hope I said your name right. Bahia Svelte? Bahia Svelte? What's happening? I'm Michael. Nice to meet you. What's up? Hi there, mister. Or as Arthur would say, hi there, mister. Shut up. Did you say shut up? We are way up in the mountains, waiting for a grizzly bear to pop out. I can't believe I found a dinosaur bone today. That is so cool. Another nice view. 
Beautiful. Beautiful view. Of course, I have a bounty everywhere I go. Oh, sorry, missus. Yep. Nice to meet you. Just the same. You're a gamer. Okay. <laughs> well, you're in good company because we're gamers as well, and I'm a gamer. Pretty sure everyone in here has played and enjoyed this game. I'm doing my first run through it. Patch of road. I don't need you tagging along. Mister? Out of the way! <laughs> Get out of my way! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Easy, easy! Keep seeing things that look like they might be something. For a second, that those would be good. Girl. Maybe that those might be bones, but doesn't look like it. Yeah, Glenny can come back. This is a quick five minutes. I don't know what was said, but hopefully, he understands. It's just part of the game. Eyes up. Uh, eighteen ninety nine, actually. Lots of weird looking stuff here. I miss something. I miss Arthur. So up now. Try and head back yep. to where I stopped before, I think. Palmer Justice. What's happening? I'm Michael. Nice to meet you. Oh, uh, no, that, that's not working. Anything exciting here? Okay, cool. That sounds fun. <laughs> okay, my girl. I'm not sure what I missed up here. Uh, looks like there's some stuff to pick. Looks like I can do that. Hello, welcome back, Glenny. Thanks for coming back. Alaskan ginseng. Yeah, I don't know what was said, but I hope you understand. Gosh, look at Blanche. She's all dirty. <laughs> nice one, Oda. Uh, let me clean the horse yeah, real quick. There's a girl. Cool, I don't even know what was said, Glenny, but... Um, there we you go. know, for 
obvious reasons, like I'm so close to the end, I'm worried about learning things that I shouldn't. Keep looking around here, because Arthur said there was something to look at nearby. And then I'll do exactly what Driver Guy said. We'll try and line up at 3 a.m. underneath the L. Hey, what's up? Oh, what's this? This might have been what Arthur was talking about. This looks interesting. Whoa, easy. Thank you, Arthur. This is it, yeah? This looks like... What has been happening over here? What is this? It's just like we're a set of space rock. There's a meteorite. Found me a meteorite. Thanks. Thanks, Arthur Morgan. This is cool. Found a rock that had fallen from the heavens. Wow, look at that great, nice drawing. Okay, Glennie, no hard feelings on anybody's part. I think it, it's driver guy trying to just be better safe than sorry for me, and I appreciate you both. I really do. This is cool. Just a big old crater. Is there anything I should get here? Maybe some gold or diamonds? That stuff comes from space, right? Sometimes? Maybe? Nope. Yes. A blind playthrough is a blind That's playthrough. Cool. Yep. And I've done really well so far, and you guys have done really well in not in like giving me instructions, but without spoiling what's going to happen for the most part, so I appreciate it a lot. This is cool. Thank you so much, Arthur Morgan. <laughs> that was cool enough. I'm actually going to save. Because now I've put another 35 minutes in. I'm going to go check out one more one more of the outbuildings here, and then, um, yeah, back when they thought the sky was heaven. From the heavens. And everything good came from the heavens. Hey, but All right, let's uh, try and make my way to the spot that I have marked on the map. Really good call out, Arthur. That was awesome. If anyone deserves a tip today, it's you. Yes. Yes. Very lucky. Oh, that's cool. Easy, easy. Yep. A, B equals A times B. Easy. What is this? I must have missed. Okay, um, Brandywine Drop Station. Mm -hmm. Dude, thank you. Oops. Abandoned trading post. All right, Arthur, no more of this. Oh, no, we're in uh, Dead Eye and, and Drawing. <laughs> this is so epic. All right, shit just got real. Thought this old trading post in Roanoke Ridge was kind of interesting. I like Arthur's style. I've been known to carry a, a little notebook and draw and, and write things. Especially when traveling, I think it's important to write things in your own words whenever you can. Like my books from living in the Philippines are full of amazing memories that I forget every single time. Can I get into the trading post? Looks like a no. Oh, yeah, okay. Remove plank. Oh, are you kidding? Not bad. A nice $15. Okay. And it looks like... Some tobacco. Man, there's tobacco everywhere, huh? Juan Marston. Juan Marston. Oops. Ah, oh, you can sleep in here, too. Hey, the cigarette card. I see a cigarette card. 
That's cool, Oda. I was I'm better at it now, but I was not very good at at math in school. Gin, veggies. All right, I'm gonna take a quick nap here. Oof, it's like the dirtiest bed in the game, but I don't want to know what those brown marks are on the bed, but I'm going to take a little sleep. And I'll sleep right through to morning. And then we're on to the L under Lemoyne. Glenny, I have, um, I don't know how many I have, honestly, but I'm, I will take a look at the map so we can plan for Monday, but I think I have a good, good amount. I'm in probably three missions into chapter six. Murph's out there having fun. So I'll show you. Chapter six. I've done this many so far. So I think I have, let's see, that's two, four, six, eight, ten. So I'm assuming that there's going to be another handful in this chapter. That's really good advice. Did you say dark chocolate? I think I have regular chocolate. I have to be there at 3 a.m. exactly. Okay, so I'll go and set up. This might be a little time consuming, but I'll figure it out. Did Arthur note this on the map? Awesome, the map's getting drawings all over it. Things you love to see. Oh, there's some dead guys over there. All right, let's look for Lemoyne. Uh, ba -ba -ba. God, where is Lemoyne? Ah, there we go. The L. So I'm gonna fast travel to Lagras. And hopefully that'll kill some time. And then I'll ride over there. That's a really good advice, Oda. Down to Lagras. I will, I will. It's a good idea. I've been trying to pick up outfits like in the rare times that I do get to play this when I'm not um, streaming here and there. I got all of them from Valentine. Um, I don't have all of them in St. Denny yet. But there's some nice ones there. Okay, I'll go back to that driver guy. That's good to know. Still more stuff up there. That's crazy. I've played, what, 60 or 70 hours, 80 hours of this game, and I've never even walked through that area. Should I dress up for the final missions? Like, do I have to wear, like, a button-down and... Maybe... I should have been growing my mustache. So I just have the... Because I'm loving... He's he's really gritty right now, but his mustache is huge. A uh, legendary animal, huh? You don't say. That's a good way to kill some time. What legendary animal is here? Hmm. I've already got the legendary croc. What else is around here? There really is. Alright, it must just be telling me that because... I'm not sure why. Okay. All right. I'll see if I can dig that out. <laughs> I'll see if I can dig that out. God, I don't even... I, I'm sure it's there. I can at least get the, uh, like the blanket and stuff like that. Headphones don't work with the hat, but maybe I can work something out just for that stream. All right. So I'm going to head over there on foot. Hopefully... Oh, that's where I found the dinosaur bone, too. Okay. 
So I'm going to head over to just target this. Uh, maybe I'll go spend the night in Pleasance. Oh, there's a legendary fish? Yeah, I don't see it on the map, though. That's weird. Right? Nothing. It easily could have been. Or is it... No? Good idea. Hey, mister. She needs some food. Nice job. I do, so I should use my, um, varmint so I can get it perfect. I haven't fired this thing right lately. What I was thinking is just making it someplace where I can go up there and be there right on time. That's a nice looking rifle. For such a small thing, it looks really fun. This game's got me looking out for so many funny things. I'm looking for more like mutated trees. All that good stuff. In Lagras, the camp was... God, that's a good question. Was it here? I think it might have been right here. Funny, now there's a stranger there. So I'll keep going to here, and while I'm going, I'll try and keep my eye open for foxes. Oh, it was already clean. Got you. I'm trying to, like, kill some time because it's so early in the day. Yeah, it's morning. I'm going to have to sleep. What's the matter, dude? You won't believe it. I got bitten again. Did you really? Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm already dying. Sorry. I won't shoot. Though maybe I should. We're doing this again. Real deep. I think this guy likes this. Suck it out of me, please. Can't believe I'm doing this. I'll Hold hear him yip in a little bit. Never again. I haven't seen Supernatural. Oh, I owe you so much, mister. No problem, dude. I can't believe you saved my life twice. Me neither. Uh, well, Me neither. I best be getting back to town. <laughs> Gonna eat a uh, uh, stiff one tonight. <sighs> That's it. You ain't getting another out. I know. Not again. Get my varmint back out. Whoops. Yeah.
Interesting. Castiel. Just a man keeping his eye out. Just looking for weird trees, dinosaur bones, Ku Klux Klan members, you know. The stuff you find when you're walking around in the woods alone. That's neat. Honestly, I'm gonna go take a look at it. I don't know what Supernatural is, but I'll go take a look. You seem passionate about it, them. Nice guitar tone right there. That sounded nice. When the music changes like that, I always expect there to be something around. And I think it's somewhat random, but... So I'm pretty close now. Oops. Have to go full map on that. Come on. There we go. So I'm pretty close. And interestingly, there's a stranger there now. Oh, do you love Supernatural? Alright. Maybe I'll have to watch the... I'll have to watch it. No doubt. Dogwater, that's my worst... That's the worst part of hunting in general is getting ticks. Especially if you get something and you have to drag it back to wherever you're camped. You get ticks. Deer and other animals have ticks. It is random. Should I go after this? Should I go into the the, the stranger, or should I wait until three p.m. or three a.m.? Up to you. It's your tip. So. Fifteen seasons, all on Netflix. It's like a biting strat. Nothing to do with the stranger. Okay, I'm gonna camp out. Do some camping. That's probably the easy... And then I'll just kill some time looking for foxes at night, I guess. Go to sleep, young man. And we'll go until full night. Nice, that was my first electric guitar. I have a bunch of random stringed instruments. Got his ukulele real close by. So Hawaiian. It's pretty cool. Just to be able to play the... Um, Any Bob's Burgers fans in here? That was the theme song. Good. Okay, cool. 1220. Better get my, my tail moving over here. Oh, okay, I get it. I get what you're saying now. You said that earlier, Cameron, and I did. I had no idea what you're talking about. Not at any fault of yours, but... Hey there. I'll keep my... varmint, I guess? Girl. And I'll head towards the location of it. Ah, it's still there. Alright, that's fine. I'll head on to... At the top of the water here. Yep. Oh. Okay, I'll find that. Oh, I think I just heard a fox. Yep. Easy. Whoa. Where are you, little bastards? For a second, yep. though. Okay, there. Um. Where the road meets the train tracks. Oh, okay. I'm still going to try and cut across and get up on the train tracks if I can. It's just quicker. So I shouldn't go up and over. That's what I was thinking is going like this way, getting on the road here, and then coming down here.
I'll wait. I know there's a little bit of a delay. Okay. Ah, right here. Okay, cool. So that's a little easier. I'll, I'll turn around that, I guess. We'll go back the other way. The other way. Yeah. Just to be safe. And it'll take some time. It's 135. I'm gonna have to hustle. Beat feet to get there. Out of the way, birds. sorts of animals out. <laughs> Two seventeen. Am I gonna make it? Just snorting. Cool. Uh, there was a fox. There, girl. <laughs> the warthog. Trying to race me? Um, you know, it's part of an outfit I bought in Valentine to gaming. I can see the exact now. note or the exact thing for you shortly. All right, so I'm here. Should I head up underneath the L or just stay right here, driver guy? Stay beside the tracks, okay? Awesome. That was cool. Very cool. Ghost train. Ah, that was rad. Very cool. That was perfect. Perfect. Let's see if I can figure out what kind of... Um... See, I'm trying to think about how I might figure this out. Uh, I think the jacket is a uh, good question. That was really cool. Good call out. Really nicely done. Now I can say I've seen that. Yeah, I'm gonna get back to a place to take a rest. Do gaming, I'll let you know what kind of jacket it is in a second here. I don't think I can change clothes here, but I can go into the city and handle. I'll just head to... Back to camp. That's it, that's all, I don't get to see it ever again. Cool, that was really cool. How's that for a supernatural, Cameron? That was pretty supernatural. The ghost.
still have these pelts on my... Let's see the journal entry. In the rain. Okay, this is all stuff I've done. There's that weird tree, there's the fish I caught with Hamish. Eagle flies, PD. Rains fall. Captain Monroe. Milkweed, okay. Legendary coyote. Mysterious home. Ah, that's cool. Drew the pro. Seems like a good place to end it, too. Back at camp, I've taken my day off. Now I'm gonna come back and... Cameron, I have not, but I would love to. I don't know if I can, but I'll try. So this jacket comes with... the... That's not it. The Dewberry Creek. <laughs> the Claremont's funny. I got a bunch of these, though. The Bretang, that's pretty badass. Seriously, and what's up, G1 Manime? How are you? Yeah, look at Pearson walking around in the rain. Stormy, I'm gonna hang out here. Boy, it's storm, stormy and loud, huh? Lal Morgan, or Larceny. Arthur's dog. Mosea, Dutch, and Arthur. Ah, oh, look at those young, young pups. Well, that's gonna do it. Thank you very much, Oda. Thanks for the tip. That was really cool. Arthur, it's great to have you. Thank you for being here. Thank you for being cool, and happy weekend to you, too. 23 likes. Awesome. Thank you so much. And thanks, Driver Guy, for helping with it. all the things you do. I appreciate you being here. Very fun. Cool dude, in my opinion. Oh, yeah, the, the Benadryl knockout. That is so loud. Um, let me go ahead and pause. It's too loud. I don't feel like yelling over the storm right now. 24. Awesome. Yes. Good night to all. Um, I'll be back tomorrow morning at 7 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. That's Los Angeles time to play some more Assassin's Creed Revelations. But the next Red Dead Redemption stream will be Monday at the same time slot, 3 p.m. PST until 5 p.m. PST. It's 510 here right now for your reference. You can do the math that you need to do. Um, yeah, I'll see you in, in our, our chat. Thank you again for the for the tip. That was really cool. And uh, until next time, as usual, um, yeah, uh, yeah, D Gaming, nice to see you. Um, Cameron, newcomer, nice to meet you. Glenny, thanks for being here. Uh, Asset, if you're still here, I know it's super late where you live. Um, but yeah, everybody, I appreciate it. This has been really fun. Yeah, now's the time to say goodnight to all my Red Dead friends. But it's time. It's time for me to go and get some Friday time on. I'm going to go say hi to Mrs. Muss and my little pup, Murph. Um, no relation to the Murphrys. And I'll see you all hopefully on Saturday. But if not, I'll check you out on Monday afternoon and we'll go a little further into Red Dead Redemption 2, y'all. Unglue, have a nice night too. I don't recognize your username, so nice to meet you. I'm Michael. I'll see you next time, all right? Take care, everybody. Take care of each other and yourselves.